this is a quick video that I wanted to do on how I set up my bottles after they were um, in the refrigerator. I take the ones that was in the refrigerator and I melt the fat off the sides with some water. Just around the sides to get the fat off. And you may hear Thomas in the background. My daughter is watching that while I film this video. So, just get the fat around the sides. So what I normally do is I use a Modella bottle and I measure out five ounces. I already have one bottle made up that has a date on it. You can't see it. It's all at the top. I'll show you one. But I measure it out. I take my marker and I put the time and the date and everything on there. The amount that I'm putting in there. I did wash my hands before this, and pour it inside. Right now, I usually wait until I have more in the refrigerator, but this is mainly for purposes of the video. So that's one. I'm going to do another one. I'm going to label this the same as I labeled the other one because there's still milk from this first one in there. Even though the majority of it is going to be this milk, I'm still going to label it as this milk. I'm done with these. I throw these right in with that. This is actually clean. I don't know why that's in here. And then this is my earlier. And this one. And I'm only going to do two of these as a final. Push the air out. And I usually take them. lay them in a deep freezer like that. After that, I'm going to make a two ounce bottle. Two ounce bottle. This bottle is going to have her vitamin D drops in it. I don't know if you can see that. You 
because sometimes she'll eat the four ounces, sometimes, sometimes she don't. Most of the time she does, but I just make sure that it's in our mouth that she's gonna finish. Put the top on, and then I write on there the date. O-N means overnight. I'll put that in there. And this should be about four ounces. There's a little bit more in there. Go ahead and put that in there. Just so it won't have to just sit in the refrigerator. Put the top on that one. These are now dirty. Label it, 10, 18, overnight. This is dirty, and this is empty. So I put these back in my refrigerator. And they're ready for when I make a bottle. I guess really quick, I'll show you how I make a bottom. Just gonna put some water in there for the purpose of the video. Usually I take the top off. Put this one on. Put a little more water in there. Put this one on. and push the air out. And feed it to her like that. And just to explain what I was talking about earlier, these are the ones with the, I don't know if you can see, it's a triangle. triangle right here and these leak see water's coming out so that's why I don't use these ones over the other ones I preferred these ones because they were white just because I like the neutral colors better but it doesn't matter how far I twist it on still gonna leak. So, that's the end of that video. Thank you for watching and see you at the next video. Thank you for watching One New Mama.